Hey guys, it's me, Obvious, coming to you live, straight from the Afghanistan trenches. Sorry about the gunfire in the background as we are currently under siege. Anyways, iDubs recently came out with a video called I'm an Anti-Masker and I'm Proud, and it rekindled the deep-seated hatred that I have for anti-maskers, as they are the epitome of stupid brains affecting normal brain. While watching the anti-masker freakout videos, you'll notice that they all stick to a script. Uh, number one, you mention America in some capacity. You say, I thought this was America, or this is America. I'm an American. This is fucking America. It's America, right? I'm in a free country. Or you can say the opposite, like, uh, this isn't China. What does this look like, Venezuela? This is China? Where are we? Is this China? Do we live in China? China? This is China? I think they think just invoking the word America is instantly going to snap people out of it. Like, fuck, I broke out of the system. I was just a, I was a goddamn cog. I swear to God, these people are like NPCs where if you talk to them more than two or three times, they'll just cycle back to one of the four things they know how to say. I think that this is just what a first world society that has never experienced real oppression looks like. Like, it's a fucking cloth with rubber bands on the side. But they treat it like it's one of those face huggers from Alien. And it just jumped. <laughs> that just finished doing laps in a pool of chloroform. What a bunch of pussies, man. Hold on there, buckaroo. You don't seem to understand the basic human psychology. You see, the government is slowly trying to erode your independence. They started off with pants and seatbelts, and now they're moving on to masks. What's next? Mandated gimp suits? I don't have to bring a note. You're not even you allowed to, to ask for anything. it. You just do your own thing. Is Thank right? you. Is that what you do? You just do whatever you want to do? It's America, right? Yeah, yeah. How dare they tell you what to do in their fucking store? The store doesn't owe you the right to shop there. They can make you have to wear a propeller hat and roller skates in order to shop there. It's not your store. You can't just walk into somebody's house with shit on your shoes and be like, Lady, 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 don't worry. This is America. I'm just here to buy the eggs in your fridge. Like, no, g get the fuck out of my house. Here's a crazy, crazy thing that separates me from everybody else in this world. Oh yeah, please do tell. <laughs> what separates you from the rest of humanity? Are you an Olympian gold medalist? The leader of a country? The second incarnation of Christ? Oh, oh okay, you don't wear a mask. Yeah, all right. We'll see that everybody are fucking sheep. And they'll do whatever they're told whenever they're told to do it. But there's a huge difference. No one tells me what to do or how to do it. Imagine that right here, he just like flips the phone around to show himself walking butt ass naked through the store. Look at these brainwashed sheep with their pants and underwear. Nice try, the government. But you're not gonna tell me what to do. I do what I want to do uh, when I want to do it. Oh, America, freedom! Not this guy. You're gonna make me wear a mask. What I find to be the juiciest bit of irony is he's walking around this convenience store, breaking up his speech pattern so that no one can pinpoint exactly what the entirety of his statement is because he'll like say a word as he passes one guy and then finish his sentence like three or four steps later. You want to know the difference between everyone in this store and me? All of these people are pussies. Jesus, like what a fucking loser, man. It would be like me walking into a church with my fucking vertical ass phone and being like, you want to know <laughs> how I got these scars? And then you have these guys making stupid videos 
like on YouTube talking about like anti mass science where they're just taking a hit of a fucking vape and breathing through it. And then YouTube takes your dumb shit down and they're just like, Hey guys, so YouTube has been taking down my videos of me spreading my ass cheeks to the camera. What is it that the government is trying to hide? That's what I'm trying to want. That's what I'm wondering about. Anyways, don't forget to subscribe if you ever want to see more videos from me. And a uh, happy new year from Afghanistan. <laughs>